Let's go just stood there and took it. Fight back, man. She's gonna fucking drop kick you. You're gonna careful. Just teleport behind her. Do your pistol shit. Pistol teleport, pistol teleport, pistol teleport. MVC freestyle. Whee! What's she doing? Just throwing fireballs and shit. Silent fireballs. Bitch just burnt my arm hair off, and now I look like fucking Chris. A Twelve-year-old boy. You're one of my best men. I'll let you handle this. <laughs> Chris is one of my best men. <laughs> Get the gem. Did Chris actually pick it up? Then I hope he did. Um. Whoa. 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 You just throw me into it. It better be a retry point here. It's not giving me any fucking save points anymore. Fuck this! I want that. I just uh, no. Oh yeah. What the fuck? It's not like it's, that's why it's silent. That's why the silent. It's just blood. And now I can't escape this little fucking shithole. Well, this kind of sucks. This is really, really shit. I can't actually get out of this area. Fuck it. We have to run through fire. No, we're not. Yet, yeah, kind of. Can we get through? No, we just. We just get stun locked in the middle of a fucking firewall, and then we get picked up and fried. Awesome. We better fucking. You better not put me back. Oh, good. What the fuck, though? But yeah, she's kind of like throwing blood and it sets on fire. That's quite cool, is that? But that's fucking lame what happened right there. Whoa. So the stairs are on fire, so I'm not getting up there. And um, you know what? Fuck you. Uh, no, oh, I'm stun locked in fire. No, I'm not. I'm just gonna fucking blow shit out of her. Just keep running. Easy enough. Fuck you. Oh, okay, you're still alive. Not anymore. Well, you know what? Keep the grain launcher on Chris? Not too bad. Not too bad. Oh, you're dead. And your fires um, are going out. Cool. There was a fucking jewel on there. Wait a minute, is it in inventory? No, because Sir Chris didn't pick it up. Where is it then? Is it on a body? It was on the stairs last time I saw it. It's not on there at the moment though. Where is it? Oh wait, no, I see it. It's there. It's flashing. There it is. I can see it. Take Alexia's choker. Yep. And check it. Appears, to be, uh, appears that the jewel portion can be removed. Take the jewel. Yes, please. So actually, watch, uh, considering all my bleat about Chris keeping hold of my, uh, my grenade launcher, it actually worked out pretty okay, to be honest. I just fucking threw about seven grenades in there or some shit like that. She didn't know what the fuck happened. Oh my god, my virus is no match for your standard issue weapons. That's like exactly how it went down. My grenade launcher is the rock. To your T virus's scissors. You stand no chance. Oh, fucking bitch. Saying that though, that was way too easy for an actual. Uh, considering. Wait, wait a minute. A fucking. Dress in evil with your, your camera, camera angles, man. That was just uncalled for, though. Been a few around here. It didn't really do that much of it until um, around this. Oh, oh fuck! Oh, you son of a bitch! Get off me! It didn't really do much of that until the, um, the last couple of hours, and now it's doing it all the time. Somebody died there, but oh my god! You just anybody else behind him? I have no idea. Yes, there's somebody else there. Oh, that was that same guy that got up. Seems quite tough. It could be the same guy, but a manual reload. Oh, what a time to manual reload. Oh, zero bullets. Anybody else here? Yes, there's still- oh no, he was getting back up again. Fucking don't know what's happening. Just wait for somebody to appear, or somebody to pop back up again, like fucking... Guess who? Right, so, Doria. And 
And what's in here? So American Wolf down there. I see you down there. Oh, green herbs. Ooh. So some green herbs there. And... I'm gonna fucking take them. My green herbs now. And this one's mine too. These are both my green herbs. I've taken them. Let's go have a look down. Oh, there's a file there. I just sat in a... T I, I, just, to be fair, it's, it was actually quite... It was actually quite easy for me to miss a file that was sat in a chair like a rig- Look at that file up there! It's just sat in a chair like it thinks it's a person! That file thinks it's a person! What kind of ludicrous is this? Wait, wait, I can't open this with my hands. Use a button then. There's a button on the panel. Push the button, yes. There you go. Oh, it's the last wing! It's the last wing, so I just need the body part of um, that key now. Take the wing object, yes. And take the American Wolf. Yes. And is that everything down here? There's a large capsule and a hidden amount of shotgun shells that I could not see there at all. Could have easily missed them. Back up the elevator. And across here? In there? You unlock the door? Okay, I unlock the door. Foot knows what with. Oh. Not really that keen on putting a shotgun with seven shells in there. <coughs> Excuse me. It's that e-cig. It's not a very nice smoke at all. It's right at the back of your lungs and your throat and it's just... Blech. It's not very nice at all. I'm going to stop using that now. Unfortunately, I don't have any tobacco until the shop opens in a couple of hours. Um, no, I don't equip. Put my pistol back on again. Put that... No. No. Use. There we go. What's this going to do then? Trading shotgun for... Nothing. I'm going to nick those rounds. I'm taking... It's not a fair... The... the, the Mechanism there is like, oh, I've got a good, I've got a f good fair trade for you, Sir Chris. If you give me a shotgun, I will give you plenty of grenade rounds. Does that sound like a fair deal? I'm like, yeah, yeah, that sounds fair to me. That sounds fair to me. I'll, um, I'll take you up on that. I'll take your grenade rounds. And um, you know what? I'm gonna take my shotgun back as well. Fuck you. He's not fucking having my shotgun. And Chris is not keeping my grenade launcher either. This is not happening again. Grenade launcher. Oh, you can't combine shit like that. Fuck it, you know what? It doesn't matter. Flame rounds. Put the wing with that. So I've got four. Dump out the herbs. And, yeah, not too bad. Not too bad. Wait a minute. Oh, you know what? I'll, um, I'll, I'll use a green herb. I'll use green. Just one green. I uh, saying that though. I'm, a, I'm, a, I'm an indecisive bastard. Take the grenade launcher. I don't. I don't like not having anything. Exp do you know? If you've got the option of carrying something explosive, usually best to do so. Usually best to do so. So let's take the grenade launcher with us. Yeah, why not? I need to have a fucking save point at some point, man. There we go. But yeah, I don't like the idea of running around with just pistol and shotgun. The pistol and the shotgun is fantastic. The pistol is fantastic at taking out zombies and dogs and shit like that. Shotgun's fantastic at taking out something that's medium sized. But you never. I, I don't know if when a boss counter is going to roll by, and if a boss counter does roll by, I'd like grenades on me. Oh, I forgot about you. The person file. Code Veronica Report. After many long years of research, I finally identified the inheritance element that administers the intelligence of man. I even succeeded in manipulating the absolute value of intelligence artificially by recomposing the base alignment of the element. I then sampled the gene of our great ancestor, manipulated its element, then implanted it into the unfertilized egg of a surrogate mother. What I didn't expect was that twins, a boy and a girl, were born. 
The boy had higher intelligence than normal, but not high enough for him to be considered a genius. However, the girl had an unmatched intelligence that easily allowed her to be classified as a genius. She was exactly what I had been looking for. The revival of our great ancestor. I already determined their names, the girl's name Alexia and the boy's name Alfred. I am certain that Alexia will elevate the name of the Ashford family to extreme glory. So really, Alexander want the big fuck up that the, everybody seems to think he was. It doesn't seem to be. Not in regards to you know the Ashford, the diabolical Ashford family plans and stuff like. It didn't seem that bad. Not really. There's zombies around. Not here though. Wait a minute. No, not there neither. What's this door? Plenty of options so far, it seems. Plenty of doors. Ooh, a save room! A save room! There's nothing unusual here. And... What's this over here? It's a key! A biohazard key! Oh no, it's a sterile... Oh no, wait, it still worked though, surely worked! It's got a biohazard symbol on the key, that, should, that must work that. Sweet, so we've got an option there now. We can do something with the tiger eyes, maybe like steal both eyes or something? Fuck knows. I don't understand what I'd need that for now. At one point, yeah, I really wanted it. But now, not so bothered. It's a portrait of a beautiful woman, the master of the Ashford family, Veronica. And there's nothing useful here. Nothing useful? Nope. Well guys, we're up to about four hours in this uh, one episode, so I believe that's as good a time as any to um, to call it for today. Good solid um, seven and a half hours, seven-ish hours or something like that of um, Curvonica, so that's not too bad that, not too bad. Save over slot two. Yes. 31. Like I said, that's as good a place as any, we've got a lot of progress done there. When we resume, plenty of options really. I've got the bio as a key to open the door, maybe do something with the tiger head, fuck knows. And um, I only need to find the body for the dragonfly key, so that's something to be looking out for as well. So I've got options there. This entire area might be like another door somewhere I can go through, maybe two. So there's plenty of options for next time. Plenty of options. Not too bad at all. Uh, I've got a few people on stream going, just end it, just end it. I don't know how long's left. I don't know how long's left. It, I mean, it could be close, but... Even still, I suspect there must be at least an hour. Maybe more than that. Must be an hour. Especially, like, where, where I ramble on at the end and stuff like that and talk about it. Add another half an hour on for that. So there's still an episode in itself for, for the um, the last part. So I'll, um, I'll get that done tomorrow. I'll get that done tomorrow. So, guys, I hope you enjoyed that. And I'll catch you next time. See you dudes!